Hello, Serial Nation. I'm Papa Swag. I'm Ben. And together we are Serial United. Welcome to another edition of Serial United. Today, Ben, we get to do something that we've never done before. Ooh. A new cereal. Ooh. One I've never eaten before. But it has one of your favorite flavors. Ha, 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 ha. Chocolate. What do you think, Ben? Uh, no. No? Not one of my favorites. However, we did go to Hershey, Pennsylvania. We've been there. Yeah, on the back, it talks about the Museum of Chocolate, and it's, I think it's a fictional museum, but really, we've been to, we have been to Hershey, Pennsylvania. Let's talk about our Hershey, Pennsylvania trips. Um, that's going to have to be you, because unfortunately, I don't remember much about it. All right, well, open up the box of cereal. But I do remember a little bit. I remember after every ride, you got a little, little, little chocolate. So, yes. So, I've been to Hershey, Pennsylvania multiple times. I don't even know if this is Hershey chocolate they use with Kellogg's. You know what this reminds me of? Smell that. You ever had the chocolate chip Pop-Tart? I don't think I have. That's This is what this smells like. It does have a chocolate flavor to it, or a chocolate smell to it. Chocolate flavor. I haven't even tasted it yet. I hear this is better dry than with milk. That's what I've been hearing. That's the rumor. Let's, let's try it out. What do you think about it? That's pretty good. What? <laughs> I'm going to take another bite. I can see why I eat this as a dry snack. Yeah, I can see that. Let's try it. It's kind of thick for milk for a cereal. Yeah. I'm going to have to try it. It does have a chocolate flavor to it with a little... It's not terrible because I'm not putting it on the side, so I'm going to give it a couple more bites. So, Ben, one of my favorite things about going to Hershey, I don't know how many times you've been there, but I know I've been there multiple times. I know we had moved from Maryland to the state of Delaware, and you were really young when we moved to Ohio. I think you were like seven or eight when we moved to Ohio. I think I was nine. Nine, something like that. Eight, I was eight. Something like that. But we have been to Hershey, both in the state of Delaware and in the uh, state of Maryland. And on Hershey, there's this free ride which you get to go to like a simulation of the museum. They show how they do chocolate automatically. At the very end of the ride, they used to, I don't know if they still do, give you a Hershey candy bar. That's just an awesome, I mean, it's a free ride and you get a free Hershey candy bar. It is just an awesome place to go. So, I don't think, I don't I think Hershey took it up with, I, mean, I don't know who Hershey took it up with. Who was that Hershey Kisses with? Was that with General, I think it was with General Mills. So, I think this is not Hershey chocolate. I don't know what chocolate. It doesn't even give us a chocolate flavor. So I'm, Just with chocolate. Yep. So, I'm guessing it's not Hershey. <laughs> but, so, what are, What were your thoughts on this cereal, Ben? I did, I thought, I thought it was really good dry. And... I'm still trying to think of what I think about it in milk. So, here's the thing. It dry almost reminds me of the chocolate chip pop tart a little bit. Without the chocolate chips, just the chocolate part. Which is really good. And then you add the milk, and you didn't, you wouldn't think that milk would make it bad. But it does. I didn't think it made it bad. It doesn't, it, it's not great. It's not good. Well, I just tasted It's better it. dry. It's better dry, but I don't think it makes it bad. I don't think it makes it good. I think it, well, I just ate it a little bit it's more like, after it soaked in milk for a while. I don't know. I think it's you like... Take another bite. Tell me what you think after it's soaked in there for a while. Okay. It doesn't get soggy. Is it any better or just about the same? It's still better dry. That's what a lot of people say. I'm going to give you a alternative opinion. I did like it dry. But I thought the milk added to it. I thought it, it did add flavor to it. It kind of dimmed the sweetness of it a little bit. So it wasn't as overpowering. And it gave more balance to it. Like there's balance to the force. You know what the force is, Ben? 
Oh, what kind of force are you talking here? Star Wars, the force. And the, we have to bring balance to the force. And the milk brought balance to the force of chocolate. Talk about the chocolate force. May the force be with you. You ever hear that saying? Oh, too many times. <laughs> Do you know what that means? Nope. The force is always with me. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> I, I, I didn't mind it. I'm going to give this a 7 out of 10, Ben. Or a C plus, B minus. What are your thoughts? What are you going to give this? And you have to do the whole thing. The whole thing? What do you mean? Well, the dry. Okay. All right. It being dry, I give it like a seven, eight. With the with the milk, it's like five. So Ben, Ben, if you want to, if you want a box, you should go get a box. I recommend go get a box and just eating it straight. So I think with the milk, it's five. Without the milk, it's like a seven or eight. But you guys should just. I think you guys should just go get a box yourself. I recommend and just eating it straight. Papa Swag, however, thinks that put some milk in it. I think also what I would suggest, and I would think this would be an interesting experiment. And maybe we Chocolate should. Chocolate milk? No, I was thinking about white milk. I was thinking about taking this snack and having a glass of milk with it. And, and so dipping it? You might want to dip it. Um, and I think that would be interesting. I mean, I don't know if it's big enough to dip. Gotcha. Or maybe pour a little bit into the cup of milk and drink it out of the milk. I used to do that with Cheerios and other cereals. Mm -hmm. I'm a little odd that way. That's okay. Oh, excuse me. I did belt on live TV. Um, how dare you? <laughs> All right, so what, what I'm trying to say, Ben, and I don't know if I'm making the point, is I think it would be also a good snack. You know, like I mentioned, pouring a glass of milk and putting it in there. Sure. Or eating that with a, either a glass of milk. Chocolate or or white milk, whatever you prefer. Uh, or if you drink like the soy milks, like the vanilla soy milk, which if I drink soy milk, that's what I would do. Or almond milk, whatever, whatever milk of you, the milk of your choice, or whatever milk you go for. I do think a cup with that would be good. I don't mind it in the cereal. I think it's a solid cereal. I thought it was not going to be great with the milk, but it was it was solid. It it didn't to me lose a lot of flavor. That's just my opinion. That's on my swagometer. I put it at a seven. Fair enough. So, I'm going to have to buy something to show the swag meter. <laughs> I don't know what kind of device we could get. Maybe something like the... Like you know how in football they have the 10-yard pole? The pole? Yeah. Maybe we get something like miniature thing and I can just kind of slide. Look at the swag meter. You're just going a little too far. Let's, let's wrap it up. What do you mean I'm going too far? The yeah, it's not wrap up. So, let us know in the comment. <laughs> let us know in the comments. What should I get to... to um, Create the swag meter. Should I get a little, like... This guy's, no, I'm not, I don't even know. Be creative. We want to hear your suggestions, what we can do, so we can kind of keep the little scores. We can just kind of move it back and forth and and see what you say and be surprised with our scores. If you if you like this video, hit the like button. If you've had this cereal, let us know what you think about it down in the comments. Share the video with your friends and family. If you're new or old around here, hit the subscribe button and then hit the bell. You'll be notified when we post new videos. That's correct. If you haven't done so yet, and if you've already done so, we just want to thank you, those of you that have been following us for a while. We appreciate your support. Those of you that are new, thank you for being part of our Serial United community. And coming up on your screen will be some of our other chocolate videos we've done. And you got anything else to say, Ben? Um, no. And just remember, grab yourself a bowl. Grab yourself a spoon. Grab your favorite box of cereal. Pour the milk. And enjoy. Till the next video, I'm Papa Swag. I'm Ben. You all have a great day.